guys, welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name is Matthew, I'm gonna to talk to you today about this 2009 Mitsubishi Outlander LS. Beautiful car, nice in black, looks really quite attractive at the front here. You do have your nice fog lights down the bottom and your attractive style headlights just at the front there. No signs of any marks or wear or anything like that right throughout the whole front section. Coming along now onto the bonnet, we do have a couple of little touched up marks just on the bonnet here, a couple of tiny little scratches as well. You're gonna find that on a black car. I'm gonna come around now to the passenger side of the, uh, sorry, driver side of the vehicle, good start. Uh, really great condition throughout this section too, so no signs of any marks or scratches indicated just on the right. Looking at your tire treads here and there's good tire treads in there and that alloy rim has just got a couple of tiny little marks on it just around there, nothing too serious. Color coded side mirrors, uh, we do have your nice uh, black paint right through this whole section too, really no signs of any marks or scratches which is good to see. Uh, we do have your cro or silver door handles here with just a little bit of wear just on that, uh, on that door handle there, uh, aside from that nothing too serious and uh, continuing right across the car, it's in really good condition. So no signs of any dents, which is really good to see. A couple of tiny little marks around, just a little one here. Aside from that, it's really great. Looking at your rear tire there, fantastic tread in there, and no signs of any marks on that alloy rim there. We come around now to the back of the vehicle. You'll find your nice uh, lip here with your rear spoiler, uh, sorry, your rear, um, reverse light and brake light. Um, you do have your windscreen wiper just there as well. Open this up here. It does open up nice and out of the way with your two gas struts. And you can actually close this down as well. So it's a really handy feature that you get with the um, with these particular models. So uh, there's lots of storage space in through here. Uh, you've got some tools and stuff just under there as well, which is good. Uh, you do have a 12 volt socket just on the right hand side there as well. And you've got a cargo blind just here too. So uh, a couple of little extras with the car. Fold that one back up. Pop this down, got your nice Outlander badging just there, reversing sensors just on the bottom there, and we do also have a tow bar fitted with this particular car. It's gonna give you a 1.5 tonne towing capacity. Coming around now to the passenger side of the vehicle, and uh, really great condition right throughout this whole back section too. You know, for a black 2009 car, uh, it really doesn't have that many marks on it, which is good to see. Another fantastic tire tread there, and that alloy rim is untouched, which is good as well. A couple of light little scratching just here, which two of those have been touched up. And aside from that, just another touched up little mark just here, and aside from that's really quite good uh, right throughout this whole front section. A couple of tiny more little marks just here and here. Uh, but nothing too serious again. And just a little bit of a mark coming through uh, that front wheel arch there, which has also been touched up. So it's only really noticeable if you're really looking for it. Another pretty good tire tread just there on the front and that alloy rim has just got a couple of little marks just around the front of it. All right guys, now we're gonna have a look at the, uh, under the bonnet of this particular vehicle. I'm just gonna get Lynn, my cameraman, to walk in there and show you what's hiding underneath that bonnet. So we've got a four cylinder, 2.4 litre petrol engine. We're gonna get 125 kilowatts of power and 226 newton meters of torque. This one here is a six speed CVT transmission. It is four by four. We're gonna get 9.3 litres per 100 kilometers. You have a 60 litre fuel tank, so you should expect to get around 645 kilometers of fuel range with this particular car. All right guys, now we're inside the 2009 Mitsubishi Outlander. Uh, pretty comfy spots in here, really nice uh, cloth seats inside these cars. Uh, we'll start on the right hand side, we've got your four electric window switches just here, your door lock and unlock button and also your window locks. Uh, a little bit above that you do have your two side mirror adjustments just here, nice and simple. Turn your steering wheel and we have uh, your headlight height so you can change the height of your headlights, um, which is really a, a cool feature there. And your active stability control button just here as well. Now we do have a nice little cup holder just here which is always handy, there is also one on the passenger side there as well. Indicators and headlights just on the right hand side and on the left hand side we have your windscreen wipers as well. Now we do have a sort of vinyl wrapped um, steering wheel here with a little bit of just wear uh, just along the, the top part here and around the right hand side. Aside from that it's in really good condition. Cruise control settings just on the right and on the left hand side we have just your audio control stuff so nice and simple as well. Showing 161,552 kilometres on this particular vehicle. 
do have a bit of storage just up the top here which is really handy um, coming down now into this is where you're going to find your uh, radio your uh, your CD player and AF, AM FM radio everything like that uh, really cool you do also have a auxiliary um, looks like an aftermarket auxiliary port put through as well so uh, it's also a very very cool feature if you want to play music from your own phone uh, swap that one down there hazard lights button in a very handy spot uh, and we do have just your heating and cooling controls just below so you've got whereabouts you want it the uh, speed you want it and the temperature that you would like it as well now we do have a cup holder and or um, cigarette butt bin or what I'd put what I would use it for is a coin bin uh, that one just pops into there and we do have a fake cigarette lighter or 12 volt socket uh, just in there bit of storage just underneath there as well your automatic transmission pop that one into reverse you can hear the reverse sensors turn on and obviously nice and simple into your drive you do have your chip tonic as well so it does work very well uh, your all-wheel drive controls here as well so you've got two-wheel drive four-wheel drive and you've also got lock two generous cup holders here as well uh, this is a really handy feature on these cars as well uh, your armrest for someone like me I'm quite tall um, it's really handy to be able to have an armrest which does actually follow you along just makes it a little bit comfier uh, you lift that up you've got a little bit of storage just in through there lift that part up as well and you've got a 12 volt socket there and a bit of storage just inside as well now looking at the condition inside the vehicle really great so uh, no signs of any big gouges or scratches or anything like that in the vinyl um, the dash looks in really good condition the seats are in pretty good condition too uh, all the carpets are in great condition roof lining has been very well looked after as well so right through the back of the car it's uh, it's definitely been maintained which is uh, what you'd like to see Going to have a look now at the service history on this particular vehicle as well. We'll just, there we go. So we've got a service at 17,000 Ks, 31,000 Ks, uh, looks like 47,000 Ks, and 72,000 Ks. 93,000 Ks, 103,000 Ks, 120,000 Ks, 136,000 Ks, 151, and the last one done by us at 161,000 Ks, which was an intermittent service. So that's an oil and filter change and a top up of fluids with a full safety inspection. So it does have a relatively good service history for the uh, 161,000 Ks that it does have. Guys, thanks for watching. I hope you're impressed. Really great car for a 2009 model. Been pretty well looked after, both inside and outside, so no big uh, marks or scratches around the car, which is really good to see. Great service history on it too. You do have six airbags with this car as well, so it is very safety uh, orientated, and there is some uh, obviously some uh, anchor points and things like that in the rear for, for baby seats, so you know that you're going to be buying a safe car. Please give us a call on 039907 0555 and ask to speak to someone in the used car department. We all look forward to your call.